We are going to figure out the inverse Laplace transform of this, and you see that S, 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 they are all in red. This is my 5, all right? And here's the trouble. We have the 3 in front of this S, and then we have this 2 in front of this S squared, right? And it's okay, because we can factor it out. So let's go ahead and factor our 3 on the top, and let's go ahead and put that all the way in the front of the inverse Laplace sign, right? And then right here, we have the 2, and then let's just factor it out as well. And then we will have the inverse Laplace. On the top, we will have what? I factor out the 3, I factor out the 3, right? So it will be s minus 5. So this is my s, and now minus this is my 5, all right? Over, this will be just s squared, right? And then we factor out the 2, so we have minus 2 times s. And then 10, you factor out the 2, so it will be plus 5. So this is really hard. Right? This question is super hard, because you have to make sure 5 is 5, s is s. s are in red, 5s are in black, all right? That's how you can see it in my videos. Anyway, on the bottom here, once again, this is not factorable and it does not have any real roots, right? So I will have to go ahead and complete the square. And let's do so right here on the side. We have s squared minus 2s, leave a space, and then plus 5. Well, look at this right here. This is minus 2. So divided by 2 is minus 1. In square that, minus 1 squared is plus 1. So add 1 and don't forget to minus 1 right away. And then you will see that the first three terms is a perfect square, and this is going to be s minus 1 square, and then this is plus 4, which is the same as 2 square. This is the new denominator, right? So here we still have the 3 over 2, and then the inverse Laplace. And let me just write this again. We have the s minus 5 over this is that, right, which is s minus 1 square plus 2 square, like this. Okay, here we have s minus 1. On the top, we have s minus 5. That's not good. We have to make sure this match with that, isn't it? But it's okay, we can go ahead and make sure, let's just do s minus 1, and then plus 1, like this. So in other words, s minus 1, and then look at this as negative 5 plus 1, which is minus 4. So, let's do this again. Right here, 3 over 2, and now let's put on a big parentheses because I'm about to break this into two different inverse Laplace. The first one is going to be the inverse Laplace, and we will have s minus 1 on the top, so let's put that down like this, and then this right here on the bottom, which is s minus 1 squared plus 2 squared, right? So this is nice. And then next one, I'm going to put down, check this out, this is minus 5 plus 1, which is minus 4. Let's factor that out. We have the minus 4 right here, all right? And then the inverse Laplace. And then on the top, I will just have a 1 now, and then over s minus 1 squared, like this, and then plus 2 squared, like that, and then close that big parentheses. Check this out. Minus 1, and this is minus 4 times 1, which is minus 4. s minus 1 minus 4, which is s minus 5, which is the original, right? So we just kind of uh, separate things because now this is going to give you some kind of cosine and something and things like that. Anyway, let me see. 3 over 2. S minus 1, S minus 1, you know the deal. I will have to get e to the 1t. So it just be t, right? Because we minus 1, right? And then this is going to give us cosine, right? Cosine of 2t. So let me emphasize, this is the 2 that we need, t. And we don't have to define any more numbers. This is great, all right? But right here, you know on the top it's just a 1, and on the bottom here we have the s minus 1. Well, I must have this 2 on the top as well, so we'll have to go ahead and multiply by 2. But be sure you go ahead and divide the 2 right here, right? So, negative 4 over 2 is just minus 2, and then this is going to give us, we have the s minus 1 here, so that's e to the t, and this is the sine part, right? So we have sine of 2t, so let's put down a 2 right here and then t, like this. At the end, of course, distribute, distribute, and we'll be done. Here we will have 3 half e to the t cosine 2t, and then this times that, the 2 will cancel out, right? So we have minus 3 e to the t sine of 2t. And then we are done. Dun, 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 dun.